one, Sam thought I'd share with you another tea taste testing video, and this one's slightly different because I've had this in my collection for, oh geez, I'd say almost two months, and I still have not tried it, which I know, I know, is really weird for me. Getting on to this tea, it is the Clipper Organic White Tea. I don't believe I have a white tea in my collection. I do like white teas, but normally I'll drink them whenever I'm out. On the packaging is this cool dragon. I mean, look at him just chilling in that cup of tea. I want to be that. I want to be this dragon, but I can't be a dragon. It's just cute packaging. There isn't really anything on here about what it's going to taste like, what it's going to be, except for that all that's in it is organically grown white tea. There are 20 of these tea bags and they come individually wrapped in the cute little packaging with the dragon. I don't know why, but dragons lounging in teacups like they're hot tubs just makes my day. A little dusty. It tastes, it, it smells quite light. I almost say it smells a little bit like fish food. Growing up, we had a jar that had like the fish flakes in it, and I don't know why, but this kind of smells like that, so that makes me a little bit worried. But, I don't know, we'll give it a try. And we're back and with a cup of tea and a puppy. He decided he wanted to come in. I think I might have just persuaded him and now he's regretting it. We'll find out later. First of all, I wanted to mention I have a new mug. <laughs> and. I needed to share this. So I bought two of these at Marshall's actually, and they are a Kate Spade China. I'm really smitten with them. Yellow is my favorite color, so they're just so cute and I wanted to share. So anyway, down to the tea instead of me rambling. It is a very, very light color, almost like golden honey or, um, oh, what is it? Or yeah, golden syrup. That's what I'm talking about. That's about the color that it is. It does smell light. It doesn't smell as fish foody, <laughs> thank goodness. Hmm. It's really smooth. But it has that subtle hint of drying on my tongue, which I've just noticed there are some teas that do this that just... Did you guys just see that? Don't drop the cup up. Anyway, so it's a very smooth blend that I can just kind of tell is a bit drying and I like these teas, but they're not something I can drink a lot of. But oh, man, is that smooth. Hmm. That was way too much in my mouth. Oh, it is way too late for me to drink in this right now. Ooh, this is getting really drying right now. I cannot sing and drink this tea. It's like drying up my throat. <laughs> it's really weird. Why am I singing anyway? I don't know. It should happen. So I think what I've kind of discovered with this is that it is very much drying. I am, what am I, like halfway through this cup right now and I feel parched. And that's a very weird sensation whenever you're drinking something. And it's not quite why I drink. <laughs> I really do drink to quench my thirst, not to get thirstier. So in that aspect, I don't really like this blend. The flavor itself is really simple. It's very simplistic, light, airy. It's very smooth and I like that part of it. So maybe I might just have to make this be a blend that I only have whenever I'm eating. Maybe, a, maybe this will be a snack one for me compared to whenever I just take tea to drink randomly. I think just the effect that it has on my mouth and my throat is just really odd for me and I don't like limiting my tea to what I can have it with and that seems to be what this would be for me. If you're one trying white tea, I think this is a very good affordable option to where if you want to try it, you can. I do think that some of the loose leaf blends I've tried before, just going to random shops, are better. It's just kind of up to you, but I don't believe I will be repurchasing this. I think that I will go for a different type of white tea if I'm to buy a white tea for my own house. That's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Tell me down below what I should try next because I am in the market for more tea at the moment because I haven't ordered any in a while and 
you know, sometimes you just gotta order some. So tell me what I should try down below. Subscribe if you want to see more from me, and I will see you in the next one. Bye, everyone.